Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play The Go Eat Jones. It's been a while, I know, I admit, I apologize. Been a bit busy, um, holidays and all that, and somebody got me a copy of the Borderland game, so I've been kind of busy in that, I apologize for that. So, let's get on with the next level here. Um, Temple of Doom, Chapter 4, Free the Slaves. Story mode, of course. Kick back and let's watch this uh, full motion video here. And you gotta get his ass killed. What uh, short round? You got kidnapped. Ouch. You got owned. Okay. This level is gonna be a bit tricky, but it's not too bad. Not like the next level, it's gonna be. Haha, uh, I gotta hate. Next level after this is a mining cart, which moves you all over the place. Literally. Yeah. I hate when they move me like that. Um, so far thing to do is gather all the studs up here. And they come all up here. Oops, just the gold one there. Got a blue one over here, so go grab that one real quick here. Blue falling onto the lava. <laughs> the rest of that we'll get in a few minutes here. First thing to do is go over to Willy. Okay, she's a better jumper. And uh, well, Willie's a better jumper than uh, Indy here. So let's get this built up. Ow, oh, come on, build it up here. No, oh, Indy can just move as fat ass up here. We just like those studs real quick. Uh, it's a daisy. Now I needed to get two boxes apart to go right here and right here. One box is right here. So it takes us over here and it wants to go here. So we'll put there. More studs. Try to minimize this as much as I can so I don't bore you to death. Now I need Indy go on this little whip platform here and uh, oops. whip, pull, and open up that uh, platform there up a little higher for Willie. So Willie can jump up, jump up, and get this box of parts here. One down, and he was right there. Now let's start building this up. Put this other one here up. Now this cart will go. Now a bit of game logic I could understand here was this here. Blows up, creates studs, but why create studs? I can't get there in time before they disappear, so was the point of the studs, you know what I'm saying? Oh well, game logic, quick and expect. That makes make sense. Now, if we had short round here, we'd be able to get a uh, chest right there through that little um, shorty door, but we don't have short rounds, so steal these bad boys here. Endless supply of bad, bad guys, as always. Oop! I kinda walk in the lava like an idiot. You didn't see that, folks. That did not happen. Hope that happen at all. The boost up there. He will win the game. I get the There's a thuggy statue right here for later on when we play. We got a thuggy. We're gonna get a chest right there. We get up to um, six chests in story mode, so the other four are all out here in various places that we can't get to yet. Okay, more studs there, and move on. Now I need to go to Indy here real quick. Whip. Start this waterfall. And create more studs, which are flying all over the place. Oops. Build up this little bar there. Oops, don't lose studs. They're very important. Not only for a score, because I don't think that. So there's your first chest right there. 
Old bad guys over here shooting bows at me. Crossbows at me. And we've got the first slave right here in the box above me. We'll go up there and free him. We'll do that by jumping up here, turning this little knob key here, and set him down. And more stuff that we can't actually collect because it freezes up until after they go away. Now, when you get doing this in free play, you don't really have to save the, the uh, slaves. You can uh, not do that. We just use short round or a short character to do that for ourselves. But in the story mode, we got to actually free the slaves, so skip that for half a second. Go over here, more studs, more studs. Chest number two. Uh, go up here. Oops, I don't. Uh, I hate this sometimes. Here. Get Indy back over here. Now, over here is your parcel. You need to blow it up, so we can't do that right now. Oops. Your parcel's there, and this piece of part right, is right here. Get the part on the platform. Turn the key and drop it off right here. Get back across. And I keep Indy here because we need him to get all the way over. They go to the uh, bloody hell other side. Come on up and out of there, thank you. What you gotta do is set this right there. Step it over here. Whip it across to you. Wish, uh, wash, rinse, repeat. All the way across. I know. They did get you a pain in the ass for that. Yeah, I just edged, didn't I? Uh, okay. You didn't see that. It did not. Oops. Happen. Nope. Didn't happen at all. And get really out of the way here. Get this part the rest of the way across. That part goes here. Now we need a wrench to fix it. So let's go find a wrench. quite go in there yet. Gotta go over here. Put out this debris. I need a shovel. Right here. Thank you. This is a shovel, finally. And all here, throw out the rest of the debris. Uh, I'll put that in a minute. I'm kind of running out of time right now, which is typical. Oops. Now, I want to keep that shovel for later. So I want to go back and get it when it respawns, I'll get it. I need it for a uh, treasure chest later. One of those, if you think outside the box, bring items into areas where you don't know you wouldn't expect to bring it into, you can do something. Now I'm going to take this okay, little wooden platform here, and I go to Indy. Get it need to be Indy because I need to go across. I hate using Indy, but oh well. Here's your post box for your parcel in free play, and I fell off the edge. <sighs> we'll try one more time. The platform completely missed it, didn't I? Well, I'm going to actually end the video right here, folks. I'll see you again in the next video. And have a good, have a good day, folks.